<laughs> Hello, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> this is the try not to laugh challenge. But I bet you won't last 10 seconds. <laughs> nope. For real though, hold on to your hearts and keep those poker faces ready. Let's go. Check out this perfect slow motion shot. Ready. Go. Oh no. He hasn't felt the pain yet. Amazing. Huh? <laughs> oh, I'm gonna try this idea. <laughs> this prank makes people want to go to heaven. <laughs> Oh my god! Oh my god! <laughs> She's okay! Oh, he's such a talented actor. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> oh! Oh! <laughs> Oh! <laughs> 
she got a free hairdo. <laughs> Oh no, he didn't have time to react. <laughs> nice. Go, go, go. The dog's used to this by now. Amazing! What an awesome barbecue party! Oh my god! <laughs> okay. Oh, that's a beautiful photo. Looks like today's party got a little too wild. This chair's only meant for one.
Thanks for watching today's Try Not To Laugh Challenge. <laughs> Hello, ladies and gentlemen. This is the No Laughing Challenge. And just one second of letting your guard down, smiles will burst out like a storm. Can you pass it? <laughs> Let's go. Oh my god! Does anyone see a bathroom nearby? This prank seems a bit too much. <laughs> oh my god! She froze for three seconds. <laughs> oh my, this is due to car breakdown, not because his friends stopped. <laughs> when you want to hold hands, but fate wants you to hold a fish. <laughs> Let's see who's tougher. <laughs> Amazing. I hold him up. Don't worry, she's just practicing roller skating. She has an impressive jogging routine. Perfect snowball. <laughs> Good! 
يا سلام شوفوا كيف شوفوا كيف Everyone got a free tattoo. What are you all thinking? Nope. <laughs> this horse thinks it'll taste better than grass. <laughs> If you don't want to sleep on the couch, don't try this with your wife. <laughs> One, two, three. <laughs> getting up. I hold him up. <laughs> Два. Один. Nope. <laughs> the slope here made him slip. Oh my god, she just had a minor fall. Are you okay? Are you okay? <laughs> He's the next chairman of the corporation. I hold him up. <laughs> He's increasing the game's difficulty. <laughs> Is that what that is? Now that, whoa. Uh oh. What in the tarnation? <laughs> <laughs> 
Thank you. Oh my god. This car has expired. She's okay. <laughs> nope. <laughs> She realized something. <laughs> oh my god He has a cool horse. <laughs> huh? What the hell? <laughs> nope. <laughs> He proposed to her so romantically. What the hell? <laughs> <laughs> Okay. This is American Idol. <laughs> Thank you for watching our video.
Tem alguém te seguindo? <risos> Ganho, tá louco, cara. <risos> Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to the No Laughing Challenge, where even a slight smirk is enough to make you the great loser. Can you hold out? Let's go. No. He hasn't understood what happened yet. Oh my god! Has anyone seen him anywhere? And he started the film. I bet she doesn't understand what just happened. Listen, the regular Tanya on my food is with Maya. Ah, you are. Nah, Minta. Talk to you, Asop. You want to sit through all of it? No question, Raman. She did a lot of the glutes. Men are the legs, glutes, and the guy. But no more of this. You love me, no? No, don't bro. Yeah, have you seen the blemish or no? Good to go, buddy. <laughs> what? <laughs> oh, I think she should stop. <laughs> He's very professional.
Ya kah? Ya, mana apa tu? Nope. I trust my wife. Oh, thankfully I haven't eaten anything today. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Hope he's okay. <laughs> Oh, isn't this hay? <laughs> oh my! <laughs> Doesn't seem too painful. Are you okay? <laughs> Her last time. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> I'm sorry. Let me protect you. Amazing. He doesn't understand what happened. Kid, can I have your autograph? Oh, 
Pode ir, é raso, é raso, eu garanto. Pode ir, sem medo. <risos> So this is why we ran out of water. <laughs> careful, careful, come here. Her bathtub is really special. <laughs> How did you find today's Try Not To Laugh Challenge? Did anyone win today? Hello, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Welcome to the Try Not to Laugh Challenge, where a single smirk means you'll lose faster than pulling out your wallet to pay. Ready? Let's go. Oh, she was quick, but he still got it from her. <laughs> oh my, he caught a big fish. He thought his belly would be more effective than swimming with his arms. Oh my god! She's okay.
Oh my. Mm? <laughs> 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 He's gonna be sleeping on the couch if his wife finds out. He still hasn't figured out what's going on. Santa Maria. Oh my god, hope everyone's all right. Oh, nobody did anything. Amazing. Oh no. <laughs> oh my. Surprise! Oh, he's planning to make an awesome jump. <laughs> Amazing. Good job. Mm? Okay.
Amazing. <laughs> Oh my god, he's so lucky. Oh! <laughs> Hope the driver is okay. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. Cadê o cabelo do Dino? Oh, amazing! Oh, the wind must be pretty strong. How did you find today's try not to laugh challenge? Are you okay? Are you okay? Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Today we'll join the latest episode of Try Not To Laugh Challenge, where your serious expression will be tested to the max. Can you keep a straight face? Let's go. Nope. Come on, anyone want to try? <laughs> nope. Ali Reporter. There's no fish at all. <laughs> Don't stand too close, buddy. Oh, oh! 
He's okay. That slide isn't suitable for him. Oh my! No, 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 no! <laughs> He should check his phone at home. Mm -hmm. huh? He shouldn't drink and drive. <laughs> Remember this memory. Whee! <laughs> Big faster. Oh my god. One. И раз, и два, и три, и раз. Oh no. <laughs> hey guys, no, 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 no. look at me. Oh my god! Oh my god! Wow! Huh? Oh no! Mm -hmm. Please! <coughs> hey, hey, hey! Huh? Amazing! I checked thoroughly. Let's go. He was very skillful, but... Hey, <laughs> 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 <Okay>, Cody! <laughs> he got tricked. <laughs> Amazing. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> 
no, 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 no. I'm afraid of this game. This position is perfect. What the hell? Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, no. Que pase, Juan, que te, ojalá que se caiga, Juan, que lo está ahogando. ¡Nope! Oh, 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 Oye, era mentira, Juan. Oh, <risa> ¡Ayúdenlo! Era mentira que... He wants to head the ball. He just wanted to check. <laughs> nope. Goodbye. Did you like this video? I hold him up. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to the Try Not to Laugh Challenge. In this nope. video, we'll compile funny moments, unexpected fails, and many interesting moments. Can you hold your laughter? Let's go. <laughs> Where did that second column come from? He will succeed. Nope. I hold him up. <laughs> Make way for the emergency vehicle. It's first time. <laughs> He's okay. Do you want to try? <laughs> no, it's not. Three, two, one, go. Nani? Oh! 
Nope. Oh my god. This pole seems slippery. God bless him. Oh my god! <laughs> she needs more practice! You should only do yoga at home. Huh? Right, and then everybody fill in. And we're going to ask you to fall and then they will catch you. So you have to trust us. I'm going to count to three. Just relax and fall. Okay? One, two, three. No, mm? Run slower, buddy. Oh no. Oh no. No, no glasses. I know. I hold him up. <laughs> He should buy a new skateboard. Nope. Love makes people confused. <laughs> She shouldn't sit there. shouldn't jump up there. The next trick is called the hospital flip. <laughs> Why is he called a hospital flip? I hold him up. <laughs> oh 
Oh my god. Did you like this video? I'm your real dad. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm your real dad. Yo, I'm your real dad. Oh, oh. <laughs> daddy, which one's my daddy? <laughs> daddy, hi. Do you want Dada? Who's that? Dada. Who's that? Dada. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> Who's that? Hi, babies. Babies. Hi. Hi, babies. Come here, real dad. I'm your real dad. No, I'm your real dad. Oh, Raya, babies. Come on, one more. She's getting scared now. I'm your real dad. I'm your real dad. She's gonna have such a hard time making this up. She thought you were her dad. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> She's like, man. 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 She's like, She looks like she's about to cry. Yeah. What is baby? Papa, Mama? Cole papa? Is papa? Tio Joe? Elena? Uh-oh. She doesn't know where to go. Yeah, no, so funny. Who's getting the food? Who's getting the food? Is that Daddy? Hello, little baby. He's like, wait a minute. Here's pick him, pick him up. You 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 pick him up? Ha <laughs> ha
Which one's your mama?
Say da da. Can you say? Da da. Da. Da da. Dada? 
Hey, mama, baby. Mama? <coughs> mama? Zoe? Zoe? Dada! She said Dada! Get out of here! Get the hell out of here! Dada, she said. Zoe? Dada! She said Dada! Get out of here! Get out of here! Get out of here! Dada, she said. Mama! Mama! Say Mama, I can't! Dada! 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 Monica, you have to go to bed. Okay, say say good night. Good night to chat. Did you just say good night? Black pork, one of the most expensive types of meat in the world. According to statistics in South Korea, the black pig farming industry generates a value of 3 million US dollars annually. Millions of premium products are supplied to the market, reflecting significant economic development and potential. Hello everyone! Do you know about the famous black pig breeds around the world? When it comes to renowned black pig breeds worldwide, many people often think of the Iberico pig from the Iberian Peninsula of Spain or the Corobuda pig, also known as Berkshire, from Japan. These breeds have produced excellent quality pork with high value in the international market. However, there is a breed of black pig in Jeju, South Korea, with a history spanning over 5,000 years. Let's explore and learn about the most modern Jeju pig farms in South Korea, where they preserve and develop this rare breed. Please subscribe to our channel to follow and support us in creating more engaging videos. Thank you all! Farmers in South Korea have created a significant source of income from breeding black pigs, especially the Jeju black pig breed, considered a national treasure originating from Jeju Island. Raised and developed in a natural outdoor environment, Jeju black pigs do not crossbreed with other pig breeds, ensuring purity and uniqueness in their genes. Jeju pork is regarded as the Wagyu beef of Japan, thanks to its exceptional quality and flavor. Therefore, the breeding method of this pig breed in Jeju carries distinctive characteristics, completely separate from conventional pig farming methods. This not only enhances the value of Jeju pork, but also highlights the unique traits of this breed in the global market. The Jeju black pig on Jeju Island, South Korea, is cared for with special attention to preserve its distinctive flavor and quality. The island's terrain, rich in minerals from volcanic soil and a mild climate, creates an ideal environment for the development of pig farming. Jeju black pigs are often allowed to roam freely in nature, enabling them to explore and forage. Nutrition plays a central role in producing the unique flavor of this pork, with a varied diet from local food sources such as natural grasses and fruits. This is believed to enrich the unique taste of Jeju black pork,
Jeju pigs, known for their delicious and distinctive flavor, require a long period of care to reach maturity, averaging from 12 to 19 months. This breed originates from wild boar, distinguished by its long snout, erect ears, petite body, and extremely agile movements. This agility not only makes them difficult to capture when they escape from pens, but also makes them a popular choice as pets in some places, thanks to their intelligence and suitable size. However, Jeju pigs are primarily raised on a large scale at farms for commercial purposes symbolizing the perfect blend of tradition and economic value. In the past, some small-scale farmers chose to raise one or two native black pigs primarily for using their manure as a natural fertilizer for crops. However, with the increasing popularity of industrial fertilizers, the trend in pig farming has shifted to large-scale farms that can accommodate hundreds or even thousands of jeju pigs. These farms not only contribute to the maintenance of a special pig breed, but also bring significant profits to the owners, thanks to the high value of Jeju pork in the market. The price of Jeju pork is considerably higher than that of other pig breeds, with pork shoulder fetching around $65 per kg, a price many times higher than that of regular pork. A 14-month-old Jeju pig, weighing an average of 70 kilograms, can provide up to 50 kilograms of meat, a substantial amount. According to data from Jeju authorities, more than 85,000 Jeju pigs are raised annually, reflecting the strong and large-scale development of the pig farming industry here. When it comes to slaughtering, Jeju black pigs are transferred to a modern processing facility, where the slaughtering and processing procedures are carried out professionally and efficiently, similar to the processes at other pork processing plants. Before the slaughter, the pigs are anesthetized to ensure the procedure is as humane as possible. Then, their hair is cleaned off with hot water, and the internal organs are removed and processed. The pig's body is then preserved in a cold environment to keep the meat fresh. Every step of the processing procedure is strictly monitored, with the ultimate goal of ensuring the Jeju pork meets the highest standards of safety and food hygiene. Korean Jeju pork is not only known for its high nutritional content, but also as a source of healthy fats. With its rich protein, iron, and vitamin B12 content, this meat helps build and maintain muscle mass and supports the production of red blood cells. Notably, the fat in Jeju pork is mainly monounsaturated and omega-3 fats, which are beneficial for cardiovascular health and support the function of the circulatory system. Thanks to the excellent combination of high nutritional value and beneficial fats, Jeju pork is not just an attractive choice in terms of flavor, but also an indispensable component of a healthy and balanced diet. Jeju black pork, known for its distinctive color and high quality, is typically prepared by grilling over charcoal or infrared grills. As the meat cooks, its natural aroma spreads, enticing the senses. Thin slices of meat, grilled until the exterior is crispy while the interior remains tender and juicy, are an irresistible highlight. What makes the Jeju black pork barbecue special is the way it is served. A variety of fresh vegetables such as lettuce, cabbage, spinach, or radishes are prepared, along with seasonings like salt, pepper, and a sauce made from garlic, chili, and lemon to accompany the meat. You wrap the grilled meat in a leaf of vegetable, add some seasoning, and dive into the captivating flavors of the dish. For visitors to Jeju, Experiencing a meal of black pork barbecue is a memorable journey not to be missed. How do you feel looking at these delicious pork slices? Would you like to try them? If yes, please leave a comment with the number 1. If not, 
do not hesitate to leave a comment with the number zero. Thank you, my friends. Let's turn our attention to a different breed of pig. The Iberico pig, a distinctive symbol of Spanish cuisine, is a rare breed raised on the Iberian Peninsula, which includes Spain and Portugal. Most famously known for Jaman Iberico, a type of cured ham with a unique flavor unmatched by any other, the Iberico pig is not just a delicacy but also a symbol of local culture and culinary tradition. The complex care and processing procedures contribute to the value and prestige of this meat. Two-month-old piglets are raised traditionally in enclosed farms. Here, they stay with their mother and receive meticulous care before being taken to the acorn fields. From February to October, Iberi Copigs aged three months and older are moved to areas with a high abundance of acorns, where their diet primarily consists of fallen acorns. This process not only helps them gain weight rapidly but also increases the oleic acid content in the meat making it tender and giving it a distinctive flavor. Oleic acid is not only beneficial for human cardiovascular health, but also contributes to the unique and rich flavor of Iberi Cocor. The care and management of the pig herd require patience and high skill. Farmers must constantly monitor the health and diet of the pigs while maintaining a clean and safe living environment for them. This meticulous care ensures that each Iber Eco Pig reaches an ideal condition before being sent to the processing facility, where they will become premium meat products loved worldwide. This process reflects the farmer's commitment to quality and shows respect for tradition and nature. When the Iberi Copigs reach the ideal condition and are ready for processing, they are taken to the processing plant through a strict and meticulous procedure, ensuring the highest quality of meat is preserved. Here, each pig is carefully health checked before the slaughtering process to ensure they meet all hygiene and food safety standards. Afterwards, the pork is quickly chilled to preserve its flavor and nutritional value. The processing of Jaman Iberico, one of the most famous products made from Iberico pork, begins with salting. This helps preserve the meat and enhances its distinctive flavor. The meat is then washed to remove the salt and starts the natural drying process, which can last from 18 to 36 months, depending on the size of the meat cut and weather conditions. Throughout the drying process, Iberico pork gradually develops its characteristic fat layer and a rich, complex flavor due to the transformation of fats and the reaction of natural enzymes. This process not only requires time and patience but also attention to the smallest details, from the temperature and humidity of the air to the positioning of the meat in the drying house. At the end of the drying process, each piece of Jaman Iberico is tested by skilled craftsmen to ensure the highest quality before being packaged for export or sale in the market. The meticulous care and processing from breeding to the final product reflect a deep respect for tradition, while offering the world delicious and unique Iberico pork products. Have you ever had the chance to taste this exquisite dish? Share your farts with us and don't forget to subscribe to the channel to support us and not miss any other videos. From the ancient gold mines of Egypt to modern mining operations, gold has always been a symbol of wealth and power. Today, we'll explore the fascinating world of gold mining, from traditional methods to cutting-edge technology. We'll analyze the mining process, refining, and its impact on the global economy. This video will delve into geological techniques, mining technology, and the complex processes used to transform ore into pure gold.
Have you ever wondered how a single ounce of gold can affect international financial markets? Join us as we explore gold mining from the earth to the global economy. Since ancient times, gold has been a symbol of wealth and power, driving humans to tirelessly search for and extract it. The rarity of this precious metal in nature only increases its value and allure. Gold is typically found in ore deposits, along river beds, or in sediments created by volcanic activity over millions of years. The gold mining process begins with thorough geological surveys. Geologists focus on high potential areas such as South Africa, Australia, Russia, and countries in the Andean region of South America. They use terrain analysis and geological structure methods to identify faults, folds, and other geological structures that may contain gold. Deep beneath the Earth's surface, magnetometers are used to measure variations in the Earth's magnetic field. They identify geophysical anomalies that may indicate the presence of gold ore. After identifying the target area, they collect rock samples for geochemical analysis. Techniques such as spectroscopy and assaying are used to determine the gold content in rock samples. Based on some data collected relating to gold and mineral concentrations in the specimens, geologists confirm this could be a major gold deposit. Do you enjoy watching movies about treasure hunting? David, an explorer, says, Every time we discover a gold mine, we're incredibly excited and might stay up all night just wanting to see it. Gold mining is a highly competitive industry, with explorers and miners constantly searching for new deposits. Mining methods have evolved from traditional manual techniques to modern technology, improving efficiency and yield. The two main methods used are placer mining and hard rock mining. Placer deposits form when weathering and water transportation separate gold from its source rock. These gold particles accumulate in river beds, streams, ancient flood plains, glacial valleys, and sometimes on beaches. Placer gold is characterized by small grains, fragments, or flakes, often mixed with sand and gravel. The simplest mining method uses a pan with a concave bottom an ancient technique that's still effective for small-scale operations.
Hand mining begins with the miner standing in the water, scooping a mixture of sand and gravel into the pan. They shake the pan in a circular motion, combined with a slight tilt, creating a vortex in the pan. Due to its greater weight, gold settles at the bottom of the pan while lighter sand and gravel are washed away. This process is repeated multiple times to separate gold from impurities. For larger deposits, sluice boxes are common tools. A sluice box is an inclined trough, typically 3 to 4 feet long, with ripples or rubber mats at the bottom. The sand and gravel mixture is poured into the top of the sluice and water flows through. Gold, being heavier, is trapped by the ripples or mats, while lighter impurities are washed away. The sluice box mining process begins with digging or pumping the skin and gravel mixture onto the sluice. Water is continuously pumped through the sluice, creating a flow to separate the gold. Periodically, the water flow is stopped to recover the accumulated gold in the sluice. The collected gold is then further refined using methods such as mechanic. Dredging is a more modern method, suitable for underwater deposits. The process begins by lowering a suction hose to the bottom of a river or lake. A powerful pump sucks up a mixture of mud, sand, and gravel to the surface. This mixture is passed through a screening system to remove coarse materials. The remainder is then processed through sluice boxes or shaking tables to separate the gold. Waste water and sediment are treated before being discharged back into the environment to reduce ecological impact. Oh yeah. Hard rock gold mining requires more complex techniques than placing mining. Gold and hard rock is often found in veins, requiring rock crushing to release it. Unlike placer deposits, Hard rock gold has lower concentrations but larger reserves, suitable for industrial scale mining. For open pit mines, the extraction process uses heavy machinery. Giant excavators dig earth and rock, loading it onto specialized conveyors capable of carrying hundreds of tons. The conveyor system transports ore to the primary crushing, where rocks are broken down. Then, conveyors move the crushed rock to reaching the precipitation stages for gold extraction. Deep underground mining typically uses two main methods, drift and stoke mining. Drift mining involves digging horizontal and vertical tunnels to excess ore veins. Miners use drills and explosives to break the rock. Then transport the ore out using mine carts or conveyors. Stoke mining, also known as block caving, begins by digging the vertical shaft from the surface to the ore body. Ore is extracted from the bottom up, creating a large void. Waste rock from above collapses to fill the mine space, while ore is collected through chutes and transported to the surface.
compared to placer mining. Hard rock mining requires larger investments in technology and capital, but can extract larger and more stable reserves. Placer mining is suitable for small-scale operations, while hard rock mining is appropriate for large-scale, long-term projects. The use of machinery in gold mining brings much higher efficiency compared to manual methods using picks and shovels. Machinery can process larger volumes of earth and rock in less time, significantly increasing output. In terms of safety, machinery helps minimize risks for workers operating in dangerous environments. However, the use of machinery also requires substantial investment and can cause more severe environmental impacts if not properly managed. Modern open pit gold mines are massive mining operations, comparable to man-made wonders. Some mines can measure several miles in diameter and hundreds of meters deep, creating enormous holes on the Earth's surface. For example, the Bingham Canyon mine in Utah, USA, is nearly 2.5 miles wide and over 0.75 miles deep making it one of the largest man-made excavations in the world. Modern mining techniques are exemplified by the use of gigantic machinery. Excavators can lift 120 short tons of earth and rock in a single scoop, while haul trucks can carry loads of up to 400 short tons. These machines are not only impressive in size, but also in efficiency allowing for continuous 24 by 7 mining operations. For large rock structures, blasting methods are widely used. Detonations are carefully controlled to optimize rock breakage without endangering equipment and personnel. Gold extracted from ore often contains impurities such as silver, copper, zinc, and other metals. To achieve the purity required for industrial and commercial applications, raw gold must undergo a thorough refining process. The refining process begins by melting raw gold in a furnace at temperatures around 1,200 degrees Celsius. 2,192 degrees Fahrenheit. Here, lighter impurities float to the surface and are removed. Next, the molten gold mixture is treated with chlorine or other reducing agents to eliminate remaining metals. This process is repeated several times to ensure maximum purity. Another common refining method is the Miller process, which uses chlorine to convert impurities into chlorides, which are then removed from the molten gold. For gold with high silver content, the Wohl-Wolf process uses an electric current to separate pure gold from the mixture. After refining, gold achieves high purity typically 99.5% or higher. This pure gold is cast into various forms such as ingots, bars, or grains, ready for diverse applications. In the jewelry industry, 
Pure gold is alloyed with other metals to create gold types with different hardness and colors, suitable for various design needs and consumer preferences. In the electronics industry, pure gold is widely used due to its excellent electrical conductivity and high corrosion resistance. It is often used in small components such as connecting wires and contact surfaces of electronic chips, playing a crucial role in ensuring the performance and durability of modern electronic devices. Additionally, Pure gold is also a valuable asset stored in safety deposit boxes of banks and financial institutions. In this form, gold serves as a means of value preservation, used to diversify investment portfolios and protect assets against economic fluctuations. Why do central banks still accumulate gold despite its limited appearance in daily transactions? Is gold truly an effective shield against economic volatility? Or is its value also affected by financial storms? Why has gold maintained its unique position in the global economy for centuries? Beyond its aesthetic value, gold plays roles as a traded commodity a store of value, and an industrial raw material. The global gold market is centered in major financial hubs such as London, New York, and Hong Kong. Trading occurs primarily on electronic platforms, with diverse products ranging from futures contracts to physical gold. This connectivity creates a flexible and efficient precious metal trading network. Gold prices fluctuate constantly under the influence of many complex factors, from global economic conditions to geopolitical events and market psychology. Unlike stocks or bonds, gold doesn't provide regular income. So what determines the true value of this precious metal? First, gold's inherent scarcity plays a crucial role. Limited supply and difficult extraction make gold a valuable asset. Second, gold is viewed as an effective hedge against inflation. When currency depreciates, gold often maintains or increases in value, attracting investors looking to preserve their assets. Additionally, diverse demand for gold contributes to shaping its value. Gold is used not only in jewelry, but also in electronics and many other fields. Notably, central banks' large-scale gold accumulation significantly impacts this metal's market and prices.
gold, with its ability to maintain value over time, has become a preferred means of asset storage. Unlike paper money that can depreciate due to monetary policies, gold's value tends to be more stable, making it an effective tool to cope with inflation and economic instability. In an increasingly complex global economic context, gold's position is predicted to maintain its importance. Despite the emergence of cryptocurrencies and new financial instruments, gold's unique characteristics such as scarcity, stability, and widespread recognition ensure its role. The interaction between traditional economic factors, technological advancements, and geopolitical developments will continue to influence the price and value of this precious metal. Do you like sparkling gold jewelry? Gold is not just a symbol of wealth and beauty, but also a factor influencing the global economy.
chợ trong nhà đâu mấy trong nhà đắt lắm
vào đi xong đấy máy buổi tối Hãy subscribe cho
cho nghe bảo gì nó làm đấy đấy <cười>